Okay, folks, I've been asked to do a uh, walk around of the Technima story. It's a 2015 model with a 914 Rotex turbocharged engine, and it's been converted from LSA to ELSA. And so far, I've put a full IFR panel in by adding a GTN 650 certified uh, GPS with a nav and com. It's the second com. Uh, it already had heated pitot static, so that was ready to go. And, um, as you can see, it's a sleek, small airplane. It's easy to move around. I usually pull it in and out myself. The panel has uh, two G3X touch screens, a D5 uh, backup screen. Uh, I left the original airspeed there as backup. Uh, it has the uh, built-in autopilot with the uh, Garmin autopilot controls on the bottom left there. And then behind the panel, what you don't see is the uh, built-in intercom and radios, which are all controlled by the G3X Touch. You can get ahead with them. I just didn't have anywhere to put it, so uh, it's all done through the, through the touch screens. And one of the nice things about this story, the thing that I liked the best was the baggage area, especially for an LSA. There's plenty of room back there. It's authorized to hold 77 pounds, which is more than enough usually. And uh, it even has a little baggage door here in the back, but it's kind of small. You can get like a small luggage in there if you need to. I usually just pull one of the seats up and drop the stuff in the back. And, uh, as you can see, pretty standard airplane, rudder, elevators. Uh, it's got electric trim inside and electric flaps and uh, the settings of display on the garments. So you can always tell where they're at. And uh, that's about it. So if you have any other questions, Go ahead and post them to the YouTube channel and I'll try to answer them for you. Enjoy.